the government aims to replace the temporary skill shortage TS's visa subclass 482 for employer-sponsored applicants with the new skills in demand SID visa, the critical skills occupation list. CSOL will serve as a criterion for the SID visa, focusing on the core skills pathway aligned with Australia's workforce requirements. The CSOL will function similarly to the skilled migration occupation list for the TS's visa. The draft CSOL is released for consultation, only it does not signify the ultimate recommendations jobs and skills Australia will provide to the government nor does it constitute a government decision. Note the final CSOL may include additional occupations to fulfill Australia's international trade commitments. The draft CSOL is based on labour market analysis for ANSCO skill level 1 to 3 occupations and does not encompass other temporary skill migration measures outlined in the migration strategy. For example, occupations where the median salary in the Australian labour market is above $135,000 salary threshold for the specialist skill stream of the skills in demand SID visa and below $70,000 salary threshold for the core skills stream of the SID visa may appear on the draft. CSOL the Minister for Immigration, Citizenship, and Multicultural Affairs announces the final CSOL with legislative instruments on the Federal Register of Legislation. As the authority on the CSOL, the Minister for Immigration, Citizenship, and Multicultural Affairs has the discretion to provide explanations for any deviations from the guidance given by Jobs and Skills Australia. Stay tuned, like, share and follow Auspire Immigration Services for more updated information about visas and immigration in Australia. For more personalized advice, book a consultation with our immigration experts today.